<sighs> what is going on, people? Hope you're all doing well. Welcome back to more esports talk. Why I'm here on this fine Saturday is because of a common occurrence out there. That being Linity on Twitch, not facing any punishment as of me recording this. There has been no Twitch ban, and she's done this quite a bit in the past. I'm sure if you guys are watching, you know a lot of her past occurrences on Twitch, doing some things that other streamers would be banned or suspended or even permanently banned for, and she has not faced any punishment yet. As of last night, guys, now a viral clip out there. Yes, she did slip. A nip on stream which has caused many of streamers in the past to be banned at least for three days sometimes seven sometimes longer and as of me recording this she has yet to be banned on twitch i will play you guys that clip obviously not going to show what the actual clip shows if you guys really want to see it it's all over twitter and there will be a link below if you guys really want to see it But I think the most interesting part as of now, of course, the response from many people out there calling yet again for her ban. Her response, though, is one that is very, very peculiar as she took to Twitter. As this morning, she said, hey, so regardless of whatever Twitch decides to do, I'm going to give myself a three-day suspension from the platform. I think it is fair. Have yourselves a nice day. And then in response to someone who said you can't give yourself a suspension, which is kind of true, but I understand where she's coming from. Alinity says, the heat dies down, question mark. Girl, I've had heat literally every day for two years. I have no issues streaming right away. I do truly believe I deserve a suspension. Unfortunately, Twitch doesn't handle these matters fairly and people take it out on me. What do you suggest I do instead? Even Alinity has admitted to what we have known for so long now. Even when Alinity says that Twitch does not treat everyone fairly, that's all I wanted to hear. It is a very weird circumstance, though, because she does. You know, I, I think a lot of people out there, certainly at least a few, do feel for her because she has been under a lot of constant heat because of the way that Twitch has treated her. But let's just understand this. We have no idea. We do not know what goes on behind the scenes, behind closed doors, as to why Twitch has treated her better than a lot of other streamers out there. So that's another thing that people are going to give her heat for because there are rumors a potential blackmail and connections she has to Twitch staff and that's why she has not been banned. So her taking this stance, yes, you might feel for her, but we just don't know enough details to to really know what to think about this. But at least we do know, which we have known for quite some time, Twitch is so bad at some bans that some streamers are now giving them self-suspensions and bans. Alinity taking a three-day break from Twitch as, a, as some form of her own punishment. She even says she deserves a ban Will Twitch do it? If your streamer literally says, I deserve a ban, is Twitch going to finally do it? Guys, we have seen this before. If you guys remember, I think it was actually just over a month ago, maybe a couple months back, I covered XQC. Twitch is so bad at giving bans out now. I think, I truly do think XQC went into a hentai game to try and get banned on purpose because when you come back from a ban, usually you do a lot better, especially in a case like a guy like XQC or someone like Alinity. And that's another talking point yet again against her because when you have these kind of breakout viral moments, yes, they might seem a lot of negativity going her way, but it is publicity. And oftentimes when streamers come back from these kind of moments, they do do better. It's a weird world to live in and it makes taking sides here really confusing because as much as I want to go up against Alinity because I think she has some sort of ties to Twitch, I just, I just don't know. And I, I do feel for her to some extent. So whether or not Twitch ends up banning her, we have Alinity admitting two things. One, she deserved a ban. And two, that Twitch does not treat every streamer the same way. Which is, it's pretty crazy to hear Alinity say as well. But if she admits to it, you've got to expect, well, and we know it, it's true. These are weird, weird times, and I hope you guys all enjoy. Feel free to give your thoughts and comments down below. Um, you know, just a... Uh this is an interesting one. Again, as me recording this, there has been no Twitch ban. If there is a Twitch ban, certainly I will cover it. And I, I do not know what the outcome of this is going to be. Apparently, Alinity will give herself, she will give herself a three-day Twitch ban, and we will see her back on the platform and probably still doing just fine. Until next time, drink your Wawa, drink your coffee. Okay, bye.